Hello, welcome to Tim's Tiny Arcade, where we are going to be celebrating Contra today. Uh, Contra just celebrated his 36th birthday. Um, came out in 87, the year I graduated. And uh, I have a lot of nostalgia for the, for the arcade, the NES versions of Contra, the Super Nintendo version, which is Contra 3, The Alien Wars. I think that might have been my favorite. I know it was my favorite. Um, Super Nintendo game back in the day still is but a game I never owned was Operation C and I thought why don't we just play that one um, to celebrate Contra because I have a ton of nostalgia for it so let's go ahead and start this one and I don't know why I didn't buy this game back in, the, in back in the day because you know I I had the Game Boy I was playing I was playing Super Mario games I had uh, I had Tetris. I played a ton of Tetris in college. But uh, for some reason, I didn't get this one. I don't know why. I still don't own this cartridge today. I'd love to get this cartridge at some point. But let's go ahead and play. As you can see, I, besides being black and white, I mean, that's the way the Game Boy was. Uh, this sounds... It's got the controls, it looks like Contra, it plays just like Contra. They did an excellent job on this game. When I first played this, I was like a little worried how it was going to play, but it, it, it's, it's spot on. They did an amazing job. I got the spreader here. This is like my favorite weapon of a Contra game. I love this weapon, especially if you can get rapid fire on it. Go. Ooh, it's another spreader. Look what you get. When you get two spreaders. Did I get that weapon up there? Yeah, I think I did. Boy, I, now it's like rapid fire. This spreader just helps out so much. Taking out bosses or whatever. Turret gun. Right, first jump, another turret gun. All right, made the jumps. All right, elevator. Well, we got bosses at the top. Contra games, have, I mean, they're just amazing. I wish we would have got a Contra movie back in the day. Um, And this is a great two-player game, not necessarily this one we're playing, but, uh, you know, playing co-op on, the, like, the NES version of this, ton of fun. There go. What is that? Okay, this is like, uh, like a spreader. What do we got here? Okay, it's like homing missiles. Sweet. Now, this weapon, there was a similar weapon in uh, Contra the Alien Wars. I don't think I want anything else. Look at that. I need to hold on to this weapon as long as I can. Do not want another weapon. <laughs> there we go. We got to make them jumps. I feel like I was going to die on that last one. But like, if you know, if you don't know anything about Contra games, one bullet, you're dead. You don't have a health bar. So I mean, it's old school hard. Whoa. And if you know what's coming up, it makes it a little bit easier. There we go. Boy, that weapon makes it a lot easier. Made that jump. The Contra had bosses, which was at the end of every level. All right. Well, oh, I love this weapon. I said I'd never give. I said uh, the the spreader was my favorite. I'm thinking this might be my favorite now.
this one just kind of locks on to where you need to lock on to. I gotta make sure nobody comes left or right of me though. Alright, sub's going down. Whoa! Boy, this makes it so much easier having this weapon. Woo! Let me know in the comments what your favorite Contra game is. Um, did I get them? I got them. Woo! That weapon definitely helped. A lot of Contra is, it, <laughs> you got to have the right weapon. Uh, if you don't, it's a lot harder. If I would just had the machine gun there, I don't know if I would have made that level. And that was just level one. All right, so here's level two. Now this reminds me of some of the, I think, uh, Super C that had levels like this. Let me know in the comments. I think it was Super C. This weapon here is definitely helping out. Hopefully I can keep it. See how far I can get. I did earn an extra life. I don't think I want any other weapon. Uh-oh, what do we got here? It's like some kind of a tank. There we go, I got one gun. All right, we got the second gun. Sweet. I don't know what it was about these games, but they were just so much fun. I spent so many hours trying to beat. I think I had to use the, uh, you know, the famous code back in the day uh, to beat the. Contra games. Looks like we've got a tank coming up. I've got three lives here, but you can lose your lives pretty quick if you lose your weapon. <laughs> and see, I'm dead. Now we're going to have to do it just with a machine gun. Oh! There we go. That thing's like dropping grenades or something. Well, this is tough here. You got guys coming from the left, the right, bottom, grenades. All right, did I get that? Now what do I got to hit? There we go. Did I get it? I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get to the second boss here. Now I need a weapon. Oh, and I missed it. So we got like conveyor belts here. Oh, great. I can't fire all the way up. Let's see if I can get this guy. Here's another weapon. There we go. What weapon do we got here? Okay, good. I got my weapon back. Hopefully this uh, at least get me. I'd like to show you guys at least the uh, second boss here. I have no idea what it is. This is the farthest I've ever gotten in this game. Now this game doesn't show you the score here. Oh, it looks like they're behind me. It looks like the same kind of person I took on earlier. Oh my gosh! Alright, took out one gun. Alright, got that one. Boy, it's going to be tough. I don't even know if I'm going to make it to that boss. There we go. Let's see if I can take this turret out. There we go. Big wall. Take that out. What do we got here? Holy cow. I'm sure this is not going to be good for me. <laughs> well, I took something out. 
<laughs> and then they took me out. Anyway, guys, that was a little bit of a look at, uh, and there's my score. Uh, you could always continue in Contra so many times, but uh, we'll go ahead and end it there. I'm going to have to dive deeper into that uh, and see if I can actually beat that game. Because that 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 is right there, up there with a lot of the other ones. Um, maybe not as many enemies um, since it was like on the Game Boy, but this is an excellent game. I highly recommend if you've not played Operation C from what little I've played there. Really enjoyed it. Guys, uh, I want to thank you for watching today's video. Please like and subscribe. Until next time, guys, keep on gaming.